Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you five really good money methods that you should all be doing this week in GTA 5 Online to earn yourself very fast money. That being said, if you're going to enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like on it for me and of course make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. But now let's get into the very first money method. Alright, so the first money method we're going to be going over anybody can actually do. So if you want to do it, all you need to do first is simply open up your pause menu, then go over to where it says online, then click jobs, then play job then rocks are created and then you want to go down to where it says adversary mode and go all the way down to the bottom where you can see the trapdoor adversary mode as you can see the entire trapdoor adversary mode this entire week is going to be paying double money and double rp so once you start the trapdoor adversary mode as far as the settings go i like to put the number of teams set to two or three you can actually set it to four teams if you want to but i only recommend doing that if you have a lot of people in the game mode with you other than that, now go down to where it says team balancing, set that to on, and then go down to where it says first to win, and set that to seven rounds, which is the most rounds you can set this game mode to. Alright, so the rules of the trapdoor adversary mode is pretty simple. It's literally just a team deathmatch against a whole bunch of other teams, but the only difference with this game mode is, is as you can see, there is a timer at the very top middle of your screen. Well, once that timer does finish, wherever the red area is on the map is going to fully disappear and whoever is on that red area is going to be fully eliminated and they cannot spawn back in. Also keep in mind the red platforms once they disappear will permanently be disappeared and it's basically disappearing every single section of the map until it gets to one small square. So it's pretty simple, just make sure when the timer finishes that you are not on the red platform and also make sure by the very end of the entire timer that your team is the very last team alive. And as long as you were the very last team alive by the very end of the round, here is exactly how much money you're going to be getting. As you can see, I was the round winner. The very first place team gets paid just under $15,000, second place $8,000, third place $5,000, and fourth place $4,000. And by the very end of the entire match, as long as you were the winner, this does add up to a lot of money. As you can see, here's how much money I got paid by the very end, $237,000 and also 17,000 RP. So yeah, this money method is definitely a really good one if you want to make quick money in GTA 5 online and also lots of RP. Okay, now for the second money method, I'm now going to show you how to make $204,000 in less than two minutes. If you want to do this, all you need to simply do is come over to this exact location right here where I'm at on the map where this week's regular time trial is located at, at El Bureau Heights. Once you get over here, call out your fastest motorcycle that you own, get on top of it, and then bring it on top of the time trial. Now simply click right D-pad, but stay still. Open up your pause menu though, go all the way up here to where the checkpoint is at, and mark it. Once you've marked it, drop your pause menu, open up your phone, click where it says job list, and then exit out of the time trial just like this. From here, when you're ready, click right D-pad to start the time trial, and now take the exact way I'm going here, all the way down this hill, all the way to the road, and once you hit the road, it's pretty much as simple as you following the waypoint exactly as it shows you on your map, making sure you're holding your gas button all the way down and also your left joystick all the way up. And as long as you did those two things and you did not crash, here is exactly how much money you're going to be getting once you beat the time trial. As I said, $204,000 for only 1 minute and 51 seconds of simply driving over to a destination. Alright, that now brings us to the third money method of this video, which I'm now going to show you a money method that once again every player can do. If you want to do it, open up your pause menu, go over to online, then click jobs, then click play job, then click where it says rockstar created and go down to where it says stunt races. You'll see every single stunt race in the stunt races section is paying double money and double RP. So now start up any one of these stunt races that you want to. When it comes to choosing the settings for these races, you want to make sure that you put the race type either set to standard or non-contact depending on which one you prefer. Now what you want to do is come down to the number of laps and set it to either 5 or 6 laps. You want to set it to a good amount of laps because you need to be in this race for at least 10 or 15 minutes to make the most possible money. And if the distance of each lap in your race in particular is shorter than normal, you definitely want to set it to a higher number of laps. Anyway, once you get these settings down and you know you are going to be in this race for at least 10 to 15 minutes, you are now ready to start the race. And as some of you might or might not know, the amount of people that you have during these stunt races will determine how much money you're going to be getting paid. If you have over 9 people in these stunt races, you are going to be earning a really good amount of money and also a really good amount of RP. But you also definitely have to keep in mind that to earn this huge amount of money during these stunt races with a lot of people in it, you have to come in either 1st, 2nd, 3rd, or even 4th place I'd say, but 1st, 2nd, and 3rd place are definitely the positions you want to get if you are looking into making lots of money and RP from these stunt races. And having a custom vehicle during these stunt races is definitely going to make sure that you are in those top 3 positions almost 100%. 
But cutting straight to the money portion side of this money method, as you can see, I just finished in first place. I was only in this race for 12 minutes and here's how much money I got paid. As you can see, $45,000, but also take a look at the RP. It's also very, very good, 8,700 RP. And keep in mind, I was only in this race for 12 minutes with only six other people. So this is really good money and RP for the amount of time that I spent and also for the amount of people that are in here. Here is another example of a race that I came in first place in. And as you can see, here's how much money I got paid for this one. As you can see, $58,000 and take a look at the RP. It's also very good as well, 11,000 RP. And the best part was I was only in this race for eight minutes. So this is definitely a really good money and RP method that you can be doing this week in GTA 5 online if you are good at racing. All right, now getting into the very next money method, I'm now going to show you how to make $251,000 in only one minute. If you want to do this, it's pretty simple. All you need to do is come over to this exact location where I'm at right here on the map where this week's HSW time trial is located at, at East Vinewood. Once you get over here, what you want to do next is call out your fastest HSW vehicle that you own. Once you call out your fastest HSW vehicle, bring it on top of the time trial, click our D-pad and stay still. Now, once you're staying still, open up your pause menu, go all the way over here to where the checkpoint is at and now mark it. Once you've marked it, drop your pause menu, open up your phone, click where it says job list and then exit out of the HSW time trial just like so. From here, whenever you're ready, click right D-pad to start the HSW time trial and now what you want to do is go all the way up this road. Once you go all the way up the road, now come over here to the left of the bridge and then fall off of it. Once you fall off, you should now land on this part of the freeway Way. Once you're on this freeway, it now should give you a whole new waypoint to follow. So literally follow the waypoint all the way through, going as fast as you possibly can, also trying your best not to crash. And as long as you did not crash and you were also going as fast as you possibly could, you should have been able to beat it. And here's how much money you get once you beat the HSW time trial. As I said, $251,000 for only one minute and 12 seconds of simply driving over to a destination. All right, so getting into the very last money method now, I'm only going to quickly be going over it just because I already made a video going fully over over how to do this step by step in a guide that I made which I also will be leaving linked down below at the top of the description. Anyway, Rockstar actually added a new daily challenge that you can do in GTA 5 online but this is only going to be for the next gen GTA 5 players, so players playing on PlayStation 5 or Xbox Series X slash S. So sorry to all my Xbox One, PS4, and PC players, this is only going to be available for my Gen 9 players. So to do this event, all you want to do is open up your map and then look for the LS Taurus board, which is going to be located right here, just above the military base. Once you arrive at the board, all you want to do is walk up to it and then click right D-pad to view it. You now should see the three animals that you need to take a picture of, which for me are going to be a cow, rabbit, and also a crow. So from there, all you need to do is go all around the map and take a picture of all three of those animals. Once you take a picture of your third and final animal, it will then tell you all animals are photographed and then you will be earning a total of $100,000 after completing all three photos. And you can do this every single day in GTA 5 Online from here on out as long as you are on Xbox Series X S or PS5. If you would like to see my full guide going fully over how to do this new animal photography event in GTA 5 Online, make sure you click the video that you see on the top right corner of your screen right now. But yeah, as I said, that is going to be the very last money method of today's video. I hope you all did want to enjoy. If you did and you still haven't already, make sure you do me a favor and drop a like on the video. And of course, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel with notifications turned on that way you don't miss out on any future gta videos from me just like this one but yeah that's it for me and i will see you all in my very next video peace